Udinese versus Salernitana. Udinese minus 155. You might have to just think, wow, that's a short price. But then their host, the uh, visitors, sorry, Salernitana, a plus 440. I thought they should have been like plus 700. Salernitana plus... 0.75 is at plus 100. It's all about the home side. Udinese to score twice. Mina is at minus 119 and the draw is at plus 290. I mean, this is a game in which you're thinking it's Salernitana and they're playing away from home um, under Fabio, uh, Fabio Liverani, their new coach. Um, it's not like their their fortunes have, have massively improved, although they've got a draw on there. Um, so things have gotten somewhat better, perhaps um, under their new manager. As for Udinese, you're expecting when is the time that they're going to start really winning these games? Because we've spoken about this so many times, about the level of talent that they do have within the squad. They've always been a team that always usually produce at home, but we haven't seen that this season. At home, actually, they've only won two matches out of 13 this season, which is so bizarre to me because Udinese... Sorry, no, that's a, that's a lie. I always do this. I always give you the wrong statistics. Because, you you're, the, yeah, because you're the Serie A expert. <laughs> Yes, you're right. Actually, at home, they've only won the one match. <laughs> so <Yes. it> doesn't... <laughs> I half that in two. Um, which is surprising to me because once upon a time, this was the team that you could always rely on at home. But we haven't seen that this season. In their last six matches, they've got two losses, two draws, um, three, lo- three draws, uh, two losses and one win. You expect this is the game in which they have to start collecting points and they have to start climbing up the ladder. Um, it's going to start looking quite dangerous for them, in all honesty. And they they shouldn't ever belong to with only 23 points at this point. That's only three points above relegation at the moment. So Udinese must win this match. And this is the perfect time because this is, you could call this a relegation um, six, six points battle between these two sides. Salernitana are dead last. They've had a terrible terrible go of it recently and like we've spoken about already they just don't have the skills unless they're they're depending on Candreva to come up with something special I can't really see them getting a goal at the moment in all honesty Um, so my feeling is that this is the game in which it should be an Udinese win they should be able to score two goals to be honest with you against this bunch Um, but again with these two sides I find it very unpredictable so I'm staying away. Yeah the problem you have here though Amina and uh, Nick is that if Udinese score The three points are worth so much more than going and trying to get a second and a third because they get nervous because obviously they've been in win positions or they have opportunities and they don't take them. I was wondering though, Nick, whether the over two and a half at plus 100 was maybe a little bit fishy, whether it was a little bit of bait, the plus in front of the over two and a half. Are we looking at a maximum of two goals here and probably both going to the home side? I don't know necessarily. I mean, Salernitana's defense is so bad, right? They could concede multiple times here, and it could happen quickly where Udinese does not have to worry about anything in the second half. So I'm not really sure on the total, but I do like Udinese as the side. Uh, the, the stat of this match is, is five. Five. That's the combined number of wins of both of these two teams. It's pretty sad, really. Uh, but I do believe one team is significantly better, that of being the home side, Udinese. They just simply can't get out of their own way this year. I mean, three wins— this season, if there was ever a chance, though, to get that <laughs> that fourth win, this has to be it, right? I mean, for a team with three wins to be favored by this big of a number, I think I think there's a reason that they are. They've been a disappointment at home. You know, you said have one win, dead last in the league. They're tied with Salamatana in that department. What's very, very rare, though, is to see a team with one win yet have a positive expected goal differential, which they have, plus 0.23 per match. There's only nine teams in the league with that. They're one of them, yet they're sitting 15th on the table and they only have one home win. It's just bizarre. You just Results, you just feel like they have to come at some point, although I have said that before and I've gotten burned before, so it could happen again. But I do believe they are the side. Then you look at Salonatana. I mean, they just can't win away, right? They only have two wins in the season. None of them are on, uh, on the road. They have uh, they're, they're the number one team in the league to bet against. Against the spread, they are seven wins, 16 losses, and three pushes. So that is the best team to fade in Serie A this season. And last stat, at, at on the road, away from home, Salernitana averaged 0.62 expected goals per match, dead last, while allowing 2.25 to the other side, dead last. This just has to be the one for you today, is it right? I'm two going. Nil. I, I, two nil. Two nil. All of their numbers say two nil. Yeah, I like three quarters of a goal for the better price, but two nil I would love. That way, that would be cash it. Do you think there's a to score plus one one five? Go, Mina. Do you think there's a possibility of a draw? 
I mean, there's honestly there's no but team yeah, that has managed. Has like 100 of them. Yeah, it's 14 draws this season. I mean, it's but incredible. Do you think Salernitana will score against Udinese? Udinese I mean, they are well, goals well this equipped season. to keep a clean sheet, aren't they? This, I mean, Udini, I mean, Salernitana have scored 20 goals this season. It's not a bunch, um, but it's just under a goal this, a game, you know. And well, maybe just a bit less than that. Yeah, but yeah, there's no need exactly. There's no need to be thrown in okay. any of them quandary questions because I'm when just you look wondering. at the official picks, but yeah, we'll keep wondering because when I look <laughs> at the official picks, neither you or I have got any sort of involvement in this game. Udinese uh, minus 0.75 at minus 120, meaning if they win by one goal, it's a half win. Half push. So as long as they win, some money is going to be going towards a Nick. 